Now we're going to calculate current in a series circuit. To do that, we need to transpose the base formula. V equals I times R is for when we're finding voltage, but when we have to find current, we have to transpose. We have to know those basic functions. So I'm just going to explain how I show my students how to do this. First of all, I want to keep I because I'm going to look for current this time. So what I'm going to do is just put a little box around the I and that reminds me to leave it on that side of the equation. Next, I know I have to move R across to the other side of the equation. And when I mean the other side of the equation, it's the other side of the equal sign. I'm multiplying the resistance on that side. So to, to move it over, I have to do the opposite when I move it across. So the opposite of multiply is divide. So I have to divide both sides by R. And the two R's on this side cancel each other out. They're now gone. So we're left with I by itself. So V over R equals I. Now that we know how to transpose the formula, we can look at the actual calculations. So, we, all we need to do is find the volts and the resistance. So we've got 16 volts and we've added up the total resistance and we have 16 volts divided by the 600 ohms of resistance. So we have 0 0.26 amps or 26 milliamps.